Gina is an avid photographer. Whenever the sun is shining brightly, Gina captures the best moments and takes the most perfect pictures. After sunset, Gina brings her own light to illuminate the scene and make obscure things visible. John is a doctor. If he wants to see things inside a human body, he uses an X-ray machine or an ultrasound scanner. The scanner generates harmless sound waves, which are reflected by the body's tissue, creating a blurry image of our body's interior. For instance, the first picture of an unborn baby. <coughs> Captain Tom is always on duty, as is the radar scanner on his cargo vessel. Day and night, in all weathers, even in the densest fog, Tom can see everything around him with his radar eyes. That's because radar equipment generates radio waves, which are reflected by solid objects, such as ships, coastlines, lighthouses, and even lost containers in the sea. Gina's photo flash, John's hospital equipment, and Captain Tom's radar all bring their own sources of light, enabling them to look into something we wouldn't be able to see with the naked eye. Sarah knows that. She's a proud user of images from an Earth observation radar satellite in space. It's called Sentinel-1 from the European Copernicus program, and she's amazed what these radar satellites can make visible. For instance, in case of severe weather, Sarah stays on top of things. When it's pouring rain, Sentinel-1 can easily spot rising water levels and the beginning of floods over land areas, even through the clouds. There's no better tool for calling rescue teams into action. Just as easily, Sentinel-1 can monitor the oceans and their ice sheets over a long period of time and tell us about wave heights, potentially dangerous for ships and offshore wind farms, or about oil pollution leaked from platforms and vessels on the seas. And it shows where the pack ice has grown too thick for even the heaviest icebreakers, or detect large ice sheets growing thin and porous due to global warming simply by watching the ice from space and sending high-resolution images down to the ground. Or look at radar images of cornfields and rice paddies. They show crop growth around the world and help in forecasting the total yield. With half of the world's population eating rice every day, the difference between a bountiful and a poor rice harvest can be enormous. With all these radar images, Sentinel-1 can help save lives before real disasters happen just as John can help his patients before they fall ill or get pregnant. Hmm. It's just amazing what all these invisible rays and beams can do to make our lives safer and more enjoyable.